The answer is a banking support to small and medium industry. We are the only people who have the capability to compete with China. India has a huge set of skills. India is not the government of India. India is you. आपने पता नहीं है देखा अन्नपूर्णा वाला. The BJP is calling him to a hotel, making him apologize, insulting him, and then viral in the media. Namaste. Thank you very much for coming here this morning. It's an honor for me to come here, listen to you, and give you some of my ideas. They've made the distance here a bit big, so if it's okay with you, I can walk around there. Absolutely. The first question, this biggest question is unemployment for youth, especially, is the biggest problem. What can we do about it? The single biggest. reason in my view as to why we are having unemployment is because the basic structure of employment which is small and medium businesses is under severe attack from five or 10 really big monopolies they are not production monopolies so for example in a country like japan they have large monopolists as well but their monopolists produce things they are not simple traders our biggest monopolist mr adani mr ambani they don't produce things they simply trade things these large monopolists have a control on the political system and they are organizing a systematic attack on you people gst is designed to hurt you people demonetization was designed to hurt you people import duties are designed to hurt you people the entire structure the entire vision of india's economy under mr modi is 5 to 10 really large players and a decimation of small and medium business what is the answer the answer is a redesign gst banking support to small and medium industry technological support to small and medium industry india has a huge set of skills set of capabilities these are in different clusters if i come to jammu i'm certain that there will be certain things that you specialize in producing certain skills that you have linking those skills with finance linking those skills with technology supporting those skills and building up industries from the ground up is the way we will give employment to us that's at least our vision this question is you talk a lot about uh, increasing production in democracies but do we have the capabilities to compete with china on that scale yeah absolutely we are the only people who have the capability to compete with china this is a false notion that india cannot actually compete with china we can never compete with china with the current business system because the largest players in the land have absolutely no incentive to compete with china it's much simpler for a large monopolist to simply have access to the indian market and then bring chinese goods in here first of all you have to change the gst structure second you have to reward people who produce meaning we have to move from a model of gdp to a model of how many jobs are being created now if we are if we constantly talk about gdp and we are not bothered about how many jobs are created you are essentially punishing the producer you require a change in the national mindset how many of you small businesses how many of you have access to actual capital can you even conceptualize a world where your bank loans can be forgiven no for you if you take a bank loan you pay if you don't pay you go to jail but for an adani or for an ambani you take a bank loan you don't pay no problem you take another bank loan and they're not in the business of production they are in the business of trading they are actually the guys who sell chinese product in india so we have to rationalize some of these things banks sure they have to support big projects sure they have to support an adani sure they have to support an ambani well we can have 10 adanis and ambanis 15 adanis and ambanis 20 adanis and ambanis at least it becomes more fair and then also we can open channels for people like you the next question she is a startup owner of aromatics and from jammu i don't see any hope in startup because of the lack of funding and people from outside jnk they come and they take our funding which is our right we are from jnk we are not given any government jobs or private jobs is mainly here so at least leave some funding for our youth even that chance is given to the outside youth who come here so i have applied to iit jammu also for the startup but there is no talks for the grants because since uh, i was little i was proud that i am an indian girl and this and that but now i see in india i mean uh, within this 10 years of span there is nothing left to be proud of I mean, if if my father had well, I tell you what, there is left to be proud of. Labs. Uh, no, I tell you, I tell you. See, 
India is not the government of India. India is you. And what is proud? You have to realize what what is there to be proud of is the way you are behaving. Where your mother passed away, you are struggling, you are not getting the money, you have a dream, you are not sitting here and crying, you are not upset, you are you are standing and you say, okay, this dream is not working, let me do another dream. So India is this spirit. And this spirit is something I am very proud of, you are very proud of. Right? Now, that, now don't confuse India with the government of India. There are two different things. Don't confuse India with the system that is oppressing the people of India. This spirit is the spirit that can take on China. I have a lot of clients who initially took the registration. They were not aware of what was complicated and complications they would face. Recently, they received like notices, GST notices of around like 60 lakhs, 80 lakhs. So they were like fully devastated that how to complete it. Because उनकी पूरी capital से उस GST notice के like base tax, interest, penalty उसको pay करने में खत्म हो गया। They were fully devastated. We have to find a solution जिसे हम like उनको किसी तरीके से आपने पता नहीं ये देखा अन्नपूर्ण वाला? देखा आपने? Coimbatore में? Did you see that? The guy is telling the minister that the GST is different for the bun and different for the cream. And if I get bun and cream, then GST is different. And if I get bun and cream, then GST is different. And I mean different, because it means that it is less than that. Now, this is ridiculous. Right? And what is he doing? He is ignoring the fact that this is ridiculous. Right? And what is he doing? He is expressing his frustration. And what is the BJP doing? The BJP is calling him to a hotel, making him apologize, insulting him and then viral in the video. Instead of saying, you are right. Actually, this is a foolish idea this gst on buns and on on cream let's fix it right so it's the same idea ki bhaiya mujhe malum hai i know everything please don't comment you don't know anything and this is the central thing in the cultural culture of the bjp and it's a difference between us and them we are happy to come here we are happy to listen to you we are even happy sometimes when you are angry and you get angry at us and shout at us we are happy to do that it's our job so the first thing if statehood comes back which we are already fighting for and which we have been putting pressure on and I am confident that we will be able to force the government to give you statehood. We will run a government that is in the interest of the people of Jammu and Kashmir. Outside interference will be reduced. Jammu and Kashmir will decide its vision through its own assembly. And finally, if we come to power in India at the national level, we will remove this GST and change it. I'd like to thank all of you. I'm sorry I could not spend more time with you. I would have much rather spent, you know, one or two hours here. I am very, very happy to meet you. I'm proud of what you're doing. I'm proud of the struggle that you're taking on. All the best. Love you all. Thank you.